Siri. What is Lamington Road famous for? Lamington Road is famous for its wholesale and retail market in electronics goods. Shops on the street sell computer goods, electronic items, television equipment, and wireless equipment at rates much lower than the maximum retail prices they have a high turnover. They sell not only the latest computer-related items but even outdated electronic parts for radios like transistors, capacitors, cables, sound cards, TV tuners and adapters. So, I visited the shop called Visha World. They have an amazing collection of companions and raspberry pies and other DIY projects. This is one of the best shops in Lamington Road where you can get your components. This is like a DIY project place and if you visit Lamington Road, you should totally come here, give this place a visit because they have the best collection of components and project stuff. So, do was in the shop and this video is not sponsored by anyone. Just so you know, I'm not getting paid to say this and this isn't totally real review. So let's get into the main video and open all the parts we brought from Visha World. So here is the packet and it has the Raspberry Pi and all the other components we need for this project and a few for other projects. So this is a power bank circuit for the Raspberry Pi and that's the display. So let's begin by unboxing this. So it's a Raspberry Pi power expansion board. So the screws to attach it on the Raspberry Pi. So this is the version 2.0. It costs around 1000 rupees and this is a whopping 3000 mAh battery. It outputs 2 ampere and it has a very good battery life. But unfortunately it can't charge your iPhone but it can charge your Android phone. So that might be a good thing or a bad thing or uh, it depends on what type of user you are so let's get into the display and then I'll, I'll stop my speech so this is the best display the most bezel-less display I could ever get in the market so now I will put all the specifications of the product
Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized By the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Can't make calls collide Hold tight, hold tight Hold tight Dripping lights Paint the skies All because of you
so we ran into many other problems and then we had to buy some more stuff from China so I brought things from Banggood and I've got a pretty good deal on them so the power boost didn't seem to work with Android because we needed more current and we, it, it was just 2 amperes we needed 2.1 ampere so I bought this circuit and there's one more circuit but they didn't seem to work either because they needed a battery which is over 5000 mAh so we end up buying a power bank later on so I'll show you that unboxing too till that time just watch this and I'll show you the power bank
So guys, this is attempt number two. Our first attempt has successfully failed. So actually, the cardboard was too soft due to moisture. And so I came up with this idea with this medicine box. And I glued it up, I cut the excess, and I made it like this. So I did that off camera. So I'm just gonna put everything inside. And I had actually even made a 3D printed model, so just on the computer. I designed it thinking to print it, but then I got this idea. I found this box lying around. So I decided to use that instead of wasting money on that. And now this was a great success, and I will show the 3D printed models too. So, enjoy the process and as I said uh, if like you just want to see a video which does not have all the details it will be out soon so yeah So guys, I have made it right now and this is almost ready and it works pretty good. 
and it has a power bank which I haven't made but that's really fine it can charge with USB-C or lightning so that's really good for me and you can make this at home too and I think mostly the pros are watching this who are interested more interested in more in electronics because this is the full tutorial and if you want another one which won't be so fast forward it will come soon for sure and the end product is a bit better than this because I have put some carbon fiber coating like designing onto that and I'll be putting that in a bit after this so yeah it was a great success and I love what I've made and I do like the fact that we can switch operating systems and the camera and the speakers are pretty well and another side thing is you can charge another device from this tablet and the thing which is coming out from the power bank like the thing which is on there that was removed later because it was creating a lot of problems so yeah so I'll be back at the end of this video So guys, this has been a great success to make this project, so enjoy this installation, the first boot with the new version of Interior OS and it's recorded the next day it was launched but it had a few bugs so it can't connect to Wi-Fi so I need to wait for the new version to come out and that's it, you can enjoy the rest of the video and thanks for watching and tomorrow I'll be uploading the shorter version so that you can start ordering your parts and you can make one yourself so thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of it that's me signing out